Just over a week out from the big Clemson USC football game, the rivalry heating up. Seven News reporter Nicole Ford headed to Clemson today to find out how students are giving back while challenging the Gamecocks. It's just a little over a week out from the big football game and students from both the University of South Carolina and Clemson are already competing in the 34th annual Blood Bowl. I mean, we're the two biggest yeah. schools in South Carolina, so um, it's just been something that's been going on forever. Uh, I know that people get very passionate about it, and so this is just one more way we can hopefully beat them on top of beating them in football this year. This competition takes the athletic ability out of the equation and is all about which university can donate more blood than the other. It only takes about 30 minutes to donate, and it can make such an important impact on somebody's life. It could literally save their life. It's happening all week on both USC and Clemson's campuses as the need for blood donations rises nationwide. Always have that need of helping out. We help out of hospitals and as well as other natural disasters that are happening around you know, the US, United States. So the, the need's there, and we're always constantly collecting to provide blood for those natural disasters. For these students, the initial motivation to donate is to be the winning school. But many tell me once you're in the chair donating it becomes a reality that what you are doing can save three lives. I firsthand I know my mom had cancer, so I know the need of platelets or blood transfusions. For the first time ever, the university is getting the community involved. While their donations won't go towards the final winning count, it's an opportunity for them to show up to support the overall cause. This is not just a campus effort. This is you know, Clemson is a city. The people here are really important to us, and we really want to get them involved, get them excited. They're the fans that are screaming at the games, just like all the students, too. Now, this is just one donation location on campus. There's a total of nine. For a full list, you can find that on WSPA.com. At Clemson University, Nicole Ford, 7 News. The donations will be tallied up, and winners will receive a trophy on the field at next week's game in Clemson.